So COVID has definitely affected uh, the ministry in Uganda as well. As soon as COVID kind of came out into the world, Uganda went immediately into lockdown back in March, which means shutting down absolutely everything, including travel, personal travel, uh, the use of vehicles. And so what that ended up doing was actually um, isolating people and keeping people from being able to earn any type of income. And because there, it's more of hand-to-mouth lifestyle or survival there, uh, hunger quickly set in. In Soroti, they shut down the whole town. And so the army came in and basically kicked everyone out, including the boys who were living on the streets. So suddenly the Freedom Boys Ministry had to take on the full care of 30 boys. Uh, so we worked with them to raise the immediate funds, the emergency funds to care for those boys. And then in, in that process though, we discovered that it actually became a blessing because it fast-tracked the process in which the boys can then be resettled back into their families and in their communities. All 30 boys have now since been resettled and they're being followed up on and they're doing quite well. However, the poverty that has resulted because of COVID, increased poverty I should say, has, has caused even more boys, other boys, to come into the streets. So we have more opportunity to take in those boys and to help them um, become resettled as well.